I was so excited to try out the new play, and the menu looked great. Yes, I think I've decided. One fish, please. I started thinking to myself how I haven't been good at foot track. Oh my god. And then I saw it. Everybody get down! Holy shit, is that a sh is that a shark? <laughs> so you wanna buy packs, but you got no coins, and you wanna pack bail, but you hate FIFA points, and you wanna beat your brother with a super fly team, but your coin total zero, so it's basically a drink. You FIFA is the answer to your question. Cheap and reliable, the best on the net kid. CWB for eight percent off. Stack them coins and load your squad up. Oh wiggle wiggle wiggle. Wait, do I have egg on my face again? What's well, up, big boys, and welcome to the Super Rental Foot Trap episode! So we thought Team of the Season might have been coming out today, but alas, 6 p.m. UK time rolled around, and EA did not announce anything other than some new players that have been added in the Ultimate Team. Namely, freaking Emenike! I don't think we've had Emenike in FIFA since FIFA 15. Last year, he was in the Super League, and then uh, this year, yeah, he didn't make it in. He is now playing for West Ham as a striker, so we've got a new player along with 18 other players, uh, most of which I didn't know. We've got the uh, Dimitar Berbatov back in, and then there's a couple others which I can't name off the top of my head. So I was doing a foot draft episode for fun, wasn't recording anything, got Hero Ronaldo as my captain, and guess who I got as the next selection? 82 overall freaking Anto! If you guys have been around since the beginning of this channel, you will know that Eto is by far and away one of the most emotional players we've ever had on the channel, going back all the way to FIFA 13, and we've been following his cards throughout the years, and uh, on Ultimate Team especially, but uh, yeah, one of the most emotional players on the channel, and we got him in a freaking foot draft, rarely happens because you need an inform really to hit him, uh, given that he's only an 82 overall player. It's going to be really difficult to do. I'm thinking maybe if we can get an inform Podolski and possibly an Mbemba who's also in the Super League, which would give us some pretty good chemistry there. But uh, yeah, definitely not going to have 100 chemistry if we're going to want these two players in the squad. If you guys do enjoy the episode, hit that like button. Let's try and blast 82 likes for inform Anto's rating. As well, if you want to interact with me on Instagram and Twitter, those links can be found in the description below. But boys, we're recording. Hopefully we're recording. We played so shit in foot draft recently. Can we change things up with Super Anto? Come on, right wing. Let's see who it's going to be. Podolski possibly, and of course, Tifa's going so slow right now because of this update. Di Maria, Hulk, Victorian, and Bale. Holy freaking gamokes. Okay, so right off the bat, I think we're going to want to go Bale. Uh, didn't get ourselves any uh, Turkish League players, but hopefully we get something that we can link. God damn it. We're going to want to link really, really badly, but Iniesta looks really, really solid, so I think we're going to go Iniesta. Come on, boys. Hit me with something sweet. Let's start with the reserves. See if maybe that can trigger some sort of uh, some sort of Turkish League pull. Nani would be an option. Ooh, we get Zengen. Zengen in the Super League, which I guess would be okay. So we have to... You know what? We're going to start... You know what we could do? Maybe we could have Zengen in there and then do uh, Ronaldo as a super sub. I don't believe that that works. Super subs, for example. I don't think that actually works. When you have a player like Zengen in there, the chemistry locks in on what that would be. And then I think if you bring in Ronaldo, that chemistry will go down. But, you know, I don't really know for certain there's no way to really tell 100 but um here we go okay so ben yetter i don't believe this is his most informed recent uh, his most recent inform we've got buffal who's a new uh who's a new inform for this team of the week let's just go buffal even though we don't have any league in players so far pretty decent oh depay depay sanchez tison and um and virhenna but i think we're probably going to want to go goke just for uh, just for chemistry purposes, and then we'll see who we get here. Really, Mbemba would be the ultimate player if we can get an Mbemba. That would give us uh, that would give us some help in terms of chemistry purposes. Ligue VA, Ligue 1, Flamini, who played pretty well for us in the last foot draft, and uh, I think here maybe we'll go. Yeah, I think we'll go. Uh, we'll go Saul, who's actually a pretty solid rated card. Gets a uh, strong link with our boy uh, Koke right there. That's about. That's about, that's the hyperlink if I'm not mistaken. Uh, Troll Pardu, um, no Turkish League players, which kind of freaking sucks. Mbula, uh, Bruno, Belushi, Pardo. Uh, wish we could get his inform version of the card, but I guess we will take it. Um, we'll go Bruno there. So our midfield, full Spanish midfield right now, which is kind of cray cray. And we get our choice of some pretty sweet players. Now, this is looking like it could be pretty much a full... Spanish side. Neymar, um, 
Don't think we're gonna go Neymar. Let's go. Let's go Bartra. Always a solid. Uh, always a solid look. And can we continue this with an informed PK? No, we can't. But uh, that doesn't matter. That's neither here nor there. We've got Moreau. We've got Miranda. We've got Toprak. And uh, I think for the purposes of this one, let's just go. Um, let's go to Brock. Now, Capcom Tom said something interesting. EA have never released a team of the season. Oh shit! 99 Messi. Oh my god! All right, so I think we're 100. percent Yeah, we're 100. Of course you go Messi. Of course you go 99 Messi. 99 Messi linking up with Iniesta. He's already on 10. And then we've got Anto there on four. But can we get that one player? Who's going to link us up? And it doesn't look like we're getting him here. Yeah, we're not getting him here. Liga Nos, uh, Neymar, Danilo. Uh, let's see who we got here. Zeeler, Marlos. Fuck it. Let's just go Neymar. We'll go Neymar. We can bring him on as a sub, not a super sub of sorts. Hulk Di Maria, Hero Ibrahimovic, who we can't use. Could you imagine? Ronaldo, a uh, Hero Ronaldo, Hero Ibra, and 99 Messi. And you know what? We actually just might take him. We might take him just because his card is that sweet. And maybe we can shuffle things around. It doesn't look like this could be a 191 foot draft, but we will see. Uh, Konoplyanka, Götze, Biglia, Diara. Again, none of these players really helping us out from a um, from a Neto standpoint. We would love a Super League, maybe midfielder, Super League midfielder or a winger. But there aren't many. Uh, there aren't many that would help him out enough to to bring the chemistry to full. You know, Bellarabi might actually use him as a midfielder. Could try that out, maybe troll him out on the left side or something like that. Oh, wait, Shedju! Oh, shit! Freaking Shedju, boys! We could play Shedju, maybe in the midfield to bring Etho's chemistry up. I don't know, would that actually be worth it? And then we get no other Super League players, but we do get Suare. Uh, Ansaldi, Onua. Ansaldi, absolute freaking beast card in uh, FIFA 13. Let's go, uh, let's go Onua there. And then let's see who we get at Keeper. Again, we have no idea what our Keeper is going to look like. Villar. Hart, Rufier. Let's just go Lux, because I feel like we probably... It'll be easier to build out a League of BBA side. See who we get here. Come on. Hit me with something sweet. And... Meb's not. What am I even saying? It's not even a question. We'll go Pepe, and then we'll bring in Bartra. And then, please. Please, maybe maybe a Ter Stegen. And they... Fuck, Alves. All right, so at least we get one. We get 84. Inform uh, Alves. And then left back... Liga VVA, come on, hit us with something sweet. We got Balenciaga, we got Felipe Luiz, and I think here, easy choice here is Felipe Luiz, and then right back, come on. <laughs> come on, boys. So the one guy we're probably gonna wanna go with is Cancelo, whose card I've never used actually looks pretty sweet. As it stands, a 186 foot draft, we got four chem, 86 rating, 94 chemistry. Holy freaking shit, boys. We got some crazy subs on the bench as well that we could possibly bring in. How far can we take the Super Eto foot draft? Let's see, can we get ourselves a super league and no we don't shit but we do get pardu hold on do it do any of these guys help us out at all yeah we get chemistry help there but all these guys are already on 10 no i think we're just gonna take pardu for the lulz we've got pards in there and freaking anto doesn't get any more emotional than that 99 messi 90 and yes then alves 181 squad rating let's get the match number one let's freaking do this all right boys here we go match number one he's got team of the year ronaldo he's got hero lewandowski 77 chemistry he's got me at midfield let's freaking go that would have been the craziest start to any foot draft ever yes let's go freaking it though one nil holy shit three minutes in messi nah that's off that's off that's off man He still freaking got it! 2 0! 60 minute! It's only match number one, boys. We got to match number three. We lost it in the last episode of Foot Draft, which was probably the trolliest Foot Draft I've ever done. And now we're up 2 0 in the 70th minute. It's not time to get excited just yet. Uh. Alright, boys, there you have it. 14 shots, 9 on target. Complete domination. Can't remember the last time I had a 60% plus possession. Eto, two goals. You know Eto's playing well when Messi and Ronaldo have basically disappeared and Eto is the star of the show. Let's get in the second half. Let's close this first match out. Oh my god. Dude, Alves is playing out of his mind right now. Oh, Ronaldo. Ronnie. Ronnie's gone. Let's make it 3-0 right here. Let's make it 3-0! Oh, 
shit. I, I can't even be mad. I can't even be mad right now. All right, boys, there you have it, match number one. And if we've learned anything from match number ones, it's not to get too excited. 9.7, four goals made of the match for it, though. Let's look at the match stats. Don't even need to look at them. We know that we absolutely freaking dominated. 28 shots, 19 on target. Holy shit. All right, boys, here we go, match number two. And coming up against a potent, potent force, he's got Legend Futre, who is the legend that appears to be given out most commonly in foot drafts. He's got Team of the Year Ronaldo, Fanta Yang, Fanta Royce, Fanta Vidal. Holy freaking shit. This is going to be a test. Royce Krispies. Sick name, bro. Oh, shit. Bruno. Oh, my God. This is it. Come on, boys. Bruno, let's go. One nil. Holy shit. Now, Anto and Bruno, players that aren't even over 82 rated, have scored all our goals. And we have the likes of freaking Team of the Year Messi and freaking Hero Ronaldo. Anto to Ronaldo. Ronaldo. Anto. Anto Finesse. And Anto Finesse, top right hand corner, 2 0. Holy shit, Anto has five goals. Plus, games, boys. That is freaking emotional as hell. Beautiful, beautiful Finesse. 2 0. Seven shots, five on target. This match is far from over. If he scores one early in the second half or any point in the second half, really, the match is still right back on. Let's close this thing out. Let's score the third goal early. Los Gates. Dude, Diego Alves has come up. Anytime we're close to conceding, he's come up so huge and saved us. Okay. And there you have it, boys. Match number two is in the books. We're going to match number three. 15 shots, 10 on target. Another dominant performance. So match number three is where we've been faltering the past couple foot drafts. Well, in the previous three foot drafts, I've gone out in match number two. Went out in match number three in the last foot draft. Hopefully, we can reverse that fortune. He's got Inform Neymar, Inform Bale. He's got Fanta Ronaldo at striker. Let's freaking do this. Can we reverse our fortune? Fanta? No way. No way. Dude. Oh my god, 1-0! Ito just keeps it in, and then freaking 3 Kem Bale puts it in with the freaking header! Wow, that effort from Ito! Oh my god, Diego Alves. If I'm being 100% honest, this guy's better than me. If he scored the next goal, if the next goal came from him, I wouldn't be surprised. But that's not how we're going to look at it. We're going to stay confident. Let's freaking close this thing out. If we can get a second goal early on, that would be huge. I see you got this, bro. Vignetta. Shit! I'm telling you, he's gonna score next. Oh! oh my god! What a save! What a fucking save! And then the beautiful link up play between Anto and Ronaldo might be sending us to the final. <laughs> if I was this guy, I, I no, I wouldn't have rage quit, but I would be so freaking pissed right now. How has he not scored? Alright, 
nothing has gone this guy's way. Pretty much everything, and this doesn't happen usually, everything has been going my way. Ito celebrating with the old man celebration. Well, this scoreline is not indicative at all of how the match actually played. This guy is really, really good. Um, what's his name? Class on Grace? Class on Grass. Hats off to you, bro. You played a great game. Wow. We're going to the final. For the first time in a long time, we're actually going to the freaking final. We have a shot. For the final, boys, I think we're bringing on the gogs. All right, boys, here we go. Coming up against Sturridge, Cam Sterling, 90 Aguero. Holy freaking the most. We're in the final. Can we freaking win it? I don't know if I've ever been in a final that's more emotional. We've got Eto as our lone striker. Flanked by Messi, Hero Ronaldo, and Team of the Year Me uh, Messi. Can we get it done? Moist is moist, moist is good. Not even five minutes moist in, we fucking can see! What a shot. What a freaking shot. He scored that! Mm. Wow, wow, wow! 61% possession! He's Look, he's taken the most of his opportunities. He's made the most of his freaking opportunities. Can we bring this back? <laughs> I just can't do it. Just, I, I just can't get it done. Just can't do it. Just can't do it. It's just not gonna happen. Some matches it just doesn't happen! Oh my god, I can't even be mad. He played well, but honestly, I don't feel like he played well enough to win the final. And is that it? That's it. I can't be mad. I can't be mad. We got to the final. It's the furthest that we've gotten the foot draft in like four or five episodes. Fuck! Hats off to you, bro. You just played better. Let's go see what our reward is. And do we at least get something sweet? Do we at least get a sweet reward? Fuck, I wanted to win that so bad. But I'm not mad. I will not be mad. Rare gold pack. And a jumbo gold pack. Wait, what is the rare gold pack? And... Oh, Godin! 86 Godin! And Khalili! And... That's pretty much it. Dude, 86 Godin is not a bad little pull there. But anyway, boys, that is the episode. Hopefully you guys did enjoy. If you did, hit that like button. If you guys are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button down below. Would have loved to have won the foot draft with uh, 82 overall it, though. But alas, it was not meant to be. I will see you guys for another upload tomorrow. Till next time, choose Later. I did. I just beat y'all!